With only a few days remaining before Ohio's contest with the Nittany Lions at Penn State, it's time for a few finishing touches. Get some good rest, keep pumping a lot of liquids uh, uh, in you. Uh, go to bed tonight with a mindset, have them on your mind. Visualize yourself doing great things out on the football field, okay? Visualize yourself doing it. And then um, get up in the morning, have it be the first thing on your mind when you get up in the morning. Let's get really ready to play a great game. It's gonna be in front of a lot of people. You got a chance to do something for Ohio football. Let's go get it done then, okay? Coach. Matt, you wanna go? Yeah, Coach, appreciate it. All right, guys, it's travel time and travel bags, all right? Anything that you uh, need to take, helmet, shoulder pads, knee braces, ankle braces, knee pads, thigh pads. Mouthpiece. Keep, mouthpiece, yes, thank you. Get that in your bags, take it to the truck. Everyone's gotta open their bag. We gotta look in every single bag and make sure. <laughs> I got my helmet, I got my shoulder pad. Knee break, knees, thighs. Mouthpiece is on the helmet, watch. Bang! Yeah. All right, there you go. Let's do it. Hey, thanks. And hey, we'll see you there. While the players rest, wide receiver coach Dwayne Dixon has his own unique way of clearing his mind before the trip. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a green kind of guy. I just want to, I don't like throwing away too much stuff, as my wife can attest to. And, but I also like keeping the earth from filling up too much. And I'm just being creative. I get me a lid like this and give me a handkerchief. But it's usually something that they didn't, the fabric of something that they didn't like. And usually things I, I confiscate to keep them from throwing them away. I usually get them and try to create something out of them, like a walk-through head or something like that. I really feel good about the guys. I think the focus has been tremendous. I think uh, they're ready to play someone else, and uh, they want to live up to everything that people think about them in terms of you know, how good Ohio is supposed to become. And most of my players think they got swagger to them. And it's hard for me to keep up with it all, but I try. Yeah. Go OU! You.
I got this little theory that if I look good, I play good, you know. Everybody like to get fresh before the game. Everybody. Yeah. I love being the away team, you know. When I be the away team, I feel like their fans are my fans. And sometimes it's just like I want to quiet them out and then just 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 to make everything like satisfying for me. Like I like to see the people get quiet and I like for it to be quiet. I want to hear the quarterback and I want my offense to be able to hear each other because that means we're doing something right. I feel like it's just going to be a show tomorrow. That's how I see it. It's going to be a show. I mean, it's going to be hard here. Touchdown, scoring, whatever you love in a football game, it's going to be it tomorrow. Throughout camp, freshman walk-on Blake Scipio has seen quite a bit. He's done everything his coaches have asked of him. So when asked if he's willing to burn his redshirt season and possibly play right away, he jumped at the opportunity. I was talking to Coach Alvin. He said he was pushing for me to go. And then I talked to Coach Collins. And he had asked me if I wanted a redshirt or if I wanted to go ahead and play. And I said, you know, I, I came here to play football. I want to get on the field as soon as I can. Um, I believe that I can get my degree completed in four years, so I didn't see a, a reason to redshirt. Perfect game for me. If I get in the game, I just want to win my personal battles. Um, as a team, you know, we, we want the W. We want the win. That's all that matters when it comes down to it. Mac runners up from 2011 Ohio. And veteran coach Frank Solich will come to Happy Valley to take on the new lift Nittany Lions. I do believe that Penn State's always been great on defense, and that gives them a chance to beat Ohio as their defense. Right, really quickly, uh, does Penn State stand a good chance of losing this game to Ohio tomorrow? Because Ohio's pretty good. Yeah, absolutely. Frank Solich has done a terrific job with this Ohio team. They won their first bowl game in school history last season. What do you think, Coach? Well, they have a chance, not a good chance, because I tell you, it's still Penn State. Mm -hmm. And Penn State does know how to win it. That's just one of many great games we've got on tap over the weekend. Let's take a look at some of them right now. Travis Carey may be missing this season due to injury, but his leadership is as strong as ever. No, I don't think of no receiver as special. Feel me? You gotta prove to me that you're special. All the hype and the talk, man. When, it, when you get on the field, talk don't matter, man. That's what you do on the field. Feel me? So, I think if you play a technique, definitely you can get hands on all day. You say whatever. You can be a dog out there, a straight dog. And you wanna be hyped like you be doing? Do all that, dog. If you wanna do that, <laughs> do it. You can be some game time, bro. It's, it's, it's different because we not playing against Mario and Dante, where we can't. Oh, you know, coach telling us we can't do this and do that. Man, do whatever you gotta do to win. Win. If you need to get back in your playbook, man, y'all wanna go over that list again so you know exactly what you in because come game time, you might not be able to hear everything, man. After that, man, just play ball, dog. Play ball, don't let no coaches, don't let anybody else get in your head and do what you gotta do, man. I think y'all have fun tomorrow. I want to be out there with y'all as much as I can, but y'all got the opportunity to, and it's going, it's coming fast, man. It's a big game, big players make big plays in big games. You want to be a big player, you feel me? You got to make some plays tomorrow. All right, man. Hey, dream about making plays tonight, man. You should be dreaming. All right, I'll see you. All right, all right. All right, fellas. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. But, uh, seems like a long time coming, but uh, but it's here. It matters nothing as to how many people are in the stands. That, that shouldn't even enter into it. What happens is what the 11 on 11 do when that when that ball snaps, and we can do that as well as anybody. So let's portray that to the nation. You know they're going to be hyped up. Uh, they're going to come out and they're going to punch us. Okay. We're gonna have to react and be ready to sustain that punch and keep pounding back at it. And uh, I want you to just think of uh, one thing, one thing. I want you to picture this. I want you to picture Court Street, the moment we had this game on. Yes, sir. Okay. <laughs>
road, baby. Let's go. Have a great day, huh? Have some fun today. Go. All day long, man. We're gonna enjoy this thing, man. It's the real deal, baby. Alright, we're gonna be like Holyfield. We're gonna take them out. Let's go. Turn away. Down, down. down the minutes now, boy. It is time to turn up. It is time to turn up. It is time to turn up. There ain't nobody to us. Play ball. Do what you do. Play with your heart today, baby. Play with your heart. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Dominate on three. One, two, three. Dominate. the rest of this season. But let's be tacklers today, you understand? Let's be tacklers today. Let's sell out on every play. Let's make it work. As we come out of that tunnel, we're coming out as a football team, okay? Y'all ready to go? Yes, All right, Defense, go. get to the ball! Greatness starts today. First play. Weller is set to kick it away, and it is kicked back into the end zone, and they will come out with it. In the middle of the field, it's Gerald Hodges for Penn State. He breaks a couple of tackles, but finally goes down. Points under center, first and 10, ball at the Penn State 12. They'll hand it off to Bill Bolton. Breaks one tackle to the left hash to the 20-yard line. On the game's opening drive, the methodical passing of the Nittany Lions offense slowly picks apart the young Ohio secondary. Lloyd hands it off to Belt. Jitterbucks his way to the 20 yard line. Ball pops free. It's loose on the deck at the 21 yard line. Penn State picked it up. Maybe. No, it's Ohio football. The Cats picked up the fumble. Keith Moore under that pile. A guy who was in that battle to replace Noah Keller, be the middle linebacker. Pretty sure it's his. As Ohio's offense takes the field, it's met by a swarming Penn State defense. Shotgun McLoin throws it over to the right side, caught by Robinson to the 40-yard line, breaks it left, broke three tackles on the run near sideline, 50. Has time, throws right, it's caught by Carter at the 15, gets through two tackles down to the six. McLoin, play action, has time, lots of time, back pedals, throws right, caught by Belton, 10, near sideline, makes a move to the end zone, and then touchdown down Penn State. Three seconds left for the first quarter, Bill Belton on the reception from Matt McLoin from six yards away. After giving up 173 yards in the first quarter, the Bobcat defense slowly begins to impose its will on the Nittany Lions, holding them to just 52 total yards in the second. 
but a blocked punt deep in Ohio territory gives Penn State a chance to score in the final moments of the first half. Throws it over to the right side, wide open, caught it, touchdown Penn State. Matt Lehman, Lehman on the reception, touchdown Penn State, 30 minutes in the books, Ohio trails by 11. Ohio will receive the opening kick for the start of half two, and the Cats trail by 11. Pendleton bobbled the snap. Now he fires it deep down the middle of the field. Ball deflected, caught by Ohio. On the ricochet, it was caught. Landon Smith scampers to the five and in. Touchdown, Cats! It was bobbled, Smith was there, gathered it in, scampered in. Touchdown, Bobcats. Let's see it, Scipio! As the second half wears on, Ian Wells and Lorenzo Fisher, Ohio's unproven cornerbacks, begin to settle in and lock down the Nittany Lion receivers. Penn State blitzes, back to pass Tyler, stands in there, lofts it over to the far sideline, it is caught, first down Ohio, and he's bumped out of bounds, inside the 20 yard line, down to the 18. Ryan Clark on the reception, over the shoulder grab. He was working one-on-one -on -one with Stephon Morris, and Clark won it. A blanket chip, turns it up to the 15, down to the 10, near sideline, bumped out of bounds. Got a first down inside the five. Second and goal from inside the one. Pendleton out of the shotgun, takes a snap, gonna run, jumps for the end zone, did he get in? He did, touchdown Cats, Ohio leads. The noise of Ohio's vocal fan section begins to echo throughout Happy Valley. Belt is brought down to the backfield. Tremaine Scott got him. Let's go! 15 minutes of hard work. Hey, we can't hit it. We were down and we came back. Jordan Thompson took contact, goes down to the 26. First down, Cats. Blankenship behind center, breaks free, got a first down across the 40, out to the 43-yard line. Third down and five at the Ohio 49. Takes a snap. Big rush on, stands in there, fires high over the middle, it's caught. A juggling catch from Bakari Bussey. First down, Cats at the 44-yard line. Tendleton takes a snap, sings it over the middle, it's caught by Smith, broke a tackle, 30, 20, 15, near side numbers, 10, dives forward to the 4, 2.59 to go, third and goal at the 5, Tyler waits and he takes a snap, steps back, fires to the left corner of the end zone, Foster out there, he caught it, touchdown Ohio, Dante Foster caught the ball, touchdown Cats, that could do it, 2.55 to go, throw the corner, no. Loin fires over the middle. It's deflected and it is intercepted. Ohio picked it off. The Cats are going to win. Jelani Wosley got it. Hello, world. Do you know who Ohio University is now? Cats 24, Penn State 14. Stepped up in the second half. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That's too good. That's still good. Come on. Hell yeah. Great job. Um, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to give this game ball away. Um, we're going to give it to Travis. All right. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
go on three. One, two, three. One, two. Let's go. One week down, 11 more to go. 11 more weeks of practice. 11 more weeks of determination. 11 more weeks of hard work. 11 more weeks to be relentless.